Hey y'all, I'm Kat and I'm back with another video. I am on my way to get my nails done. My baby girl, I mean my feet done. My baby girl treated me to a pedicure and then I'm going to my oldest daughter's house so she can do my nails because they are ratchet. So I'm gonna take y'all on this journey. Then when I come back, we're gonna do a shopping haul of all my fragrances I bought for my birthday all of my accessories, all my handbags. So if you're interested in seeing all of that, then stay tuned. This is my dinner. My bag made it since I got in late. I'm getting my nails done. And my toes are done. It felt really, really good to get my feet massaged, even though he cut my cuticle a little bit, but I'm happy with them. And my nails are finally finished. I love them, I love them, I love them. Thank you, daughter. Here's the other hand. I love my nails. That's all I can say. I love my nails. The first thing that I'm gonna start off with in my accessory haul is this eyebrow stamper. I'm gonna leave a side-by-side -side picture, but it comes with a bunch of forms. I saw this on TikTok, so I ordered it off of Amazon, but it comes with this uh, pencil, and here's the eyebrow side, and here's the marker side, and it comes with all these different stencils, and you're supposed to be able to draw your eyebrows in as it's demonstrating right here. I am going to do that on camera. So I did buy that for my birthday. But TikTok made me buy it. So I'm curious to see if it works. The next thing that I bought myself was some earrings. These were so pretty. And I got these from Marshalls. Another thing that TikTok made me buy is this pack of four perfume, empty perfume containers. Now what you're supposed to do is take your bottle of perfume and fill it up. Say like when you're traveling, you don't want to take your expensive perfume. So you take this right here and you fill it, fill it up with your favorite perfume. It comes in a pack of four. It comes in different colors as well and you fill it up, and that way you don't have to worry about your expensive bottle or your favorite bottle of perfume getting broke or lost when you travel or if you just wanna have your extra favorite scent in your purse. So let's try this. So this is something that I really don't wear. I, I took the cap off of it. Okay, can y'all see now that the perfume is in there? That is so neat. I'm so glad I tried that. I'm gonna show y'all the other one so you know it's empty. And it didn't even take that long to fill it up. 
this one has nothing in it and as you can see this one took me about five pumps and now it has your favorite perfume in it so thank you tiktok now i don't have to worry about when i travel them telling me to throw my perfume out because it's too uh, large of a size and i don't have to worry about losing it so I will leave the link to everything I'm showing you in the description box below unless I bought it in store. Okay, the next thing is I bought these sunglasses from Autos. They go with um, some outfits that I'm going to show you that I purchased. But they were on sale, I think for, they were less than $10. And I think they're cute. And I'm gonna do a head to head to toe try on haul with my clothes. So you will see these glasses and see what I matched them up with. And I thought they were really cute. And since they were on sale and I love autos, I bought these. Next thing I bought was some sunglasses from She from Shein or Shein. I don't know how to how to pronounce it, but from Shein. All of their glasses are under five dollars. Well, most of, I'm not gonna say all of their glasses, but they have some really nice glasses for under five dollars and i thought these were really really cute all of their glasses are packaged very very well and i'm glad they come in a case and they look like this i'm gonna have these on my foot head to toe try on haul as well so i'm not gonna try them on today because i'm still in my pajamas <laughs> but i thought these were so sexy I will leave the link for these glasses in the description box. The next thing I ordered from Shein was these belts. It comes in a pack of three. I needed some new belts. Oh, this is my first time touching them. They are so soft. And this is what the buckles look like. And then they have these different prints on them. Y'all, these belts are so soft. I love the gold finish on them. So I needed some belts. I got me some belts. And here are the belts. <laughs> and then from Ashley Stewart. When I said I needed to make a return, they wouldn't let me return the item because I um, got it offline. So I was in the store. I bought this belt. It's a corset belt. It's really, really thick. And it was $24.50. And it has the snap. I bought it to go around a shirt dress. So I'm glad that even though I couldn't return my item, that I went in the store because I needed this belt and it stretches, and I got it in a size 1X. Then I ordered this Louis Vuitton uh, Apple Watch band off of Amazon. I do have a Louis bag, and I um, wanted to have the watch band to go with it for when I carry my bag. So I did order this. I will leave the link in the description box. And in case you didn't know, Amazon does have a luxury um, item section. I didn't know that until I scrolled across it. So I got that. Next thing I got is just this silver coin chain. I needed some more silver jewelry. I do have real jewelry, but I don't like wearing my real jewelry unless I'm going somewhere important. This is what the chain looks like. As well as I got this one. I just think if you layer your necklaces is so sexy. This is what the chain looks like. Then it also came with this one. I will leave a side-by-side -side picture so you can see it on the model. All three of these came in one pack and they were under $12. Then I ordered a bunch of rings. They come in a package like this. I'm gonna put a ring from each pack on my finger. Let you see what it looks like. 
And here's the different styles and sizes of all five packs. And I got them in silver because like I said, I don't like to wear my real jewelry every time I go somewhere. And normally when I wear my rings stacked like this, they fall off my fingers and I lose them. So even if I lose these, I'm not gonna be upset. They come in a pack like this. They also come in a set of five. They do come in different sizes. There's plenty of sizes that you can choose to wear. Looks like they got all the sizes covered in each pack. And here's what the golds look like stacked or not stacked. I'm happy with this purchase because with these five packs of rings for the silver set and the gold set, I can always switch them up, interchange them. I, I don't ever have to be stuck with the same look. And I like the way this gold looks on my skin. Here's another silver chain that I purchased from Amazon. It comes in a package like this. I'll leave a side-by-side -side picture, but it's a three-layered necklace. And it comes with this little, I don't know what that is. And then this one looks similar to the one I just showed you. And then it has this. Like I said, I think layered necklaces is so sexy and it can elevate your outfit. So I wanted to make sure that I had plenty because as we know, once you spray perfume on these, which I'm trying to remember to spray my perfume on before I put these on, they do tarnish. And I want to keep them as long as possible, even though I didn't pay that much money for them. Let's get into the gold. Comes in a package like this. It has the toggle closing. And this is how it looks. And you wear this part in the front. And I like it because it's thick and chunky. It takes me back to the 90s. And I used to wear the big bamboo earrings. And I have this one. Comes out of a package like this. I will leave side by side so you can see exactly what it looks like. And then I have these. This is what it looks like. I love any necklace that has the lock on it because it reminds me of the Louis Vuitton lock on the bag. And it has a toggle closing as well. I will leave a side picture so you can get a better look. So I bought these as well as I bought this set of gold chains. It's a set of three. It has a toggle closing as well. And I like it because it has the coin charm. So anything with um, locks on it, coin charms and toggle closing, I'm sold. The next thing we're gonna do is my handbags. So I got this handbag lines from Sheen. This is what the inside looks like. And it comes with the strap. This is what it looks like from the back. Then I got this cream bag or ivory 
It has an adjustable strap. So you could wear it as a crossbody or you could wear it as a fanny pack. It's all up to your style. And I don't know what type of material this is, but it's not leather. But I think this is cute and simple, especially for the outfit I'm going to pair it with. And I got this bag. It's really, really big. It's bigger than what I thought. This is my first time seeing it, as well as you guys' first time seeing it. I know the material was going to be like a cotton fabric. This is what it looks like on the inside. It's really spacious. This is my chillaxing bag when I'm going to run to the grocery store, especially when you see the outfit that I'm going to put it with. It has these two handles. Then from Marshalls, I got this leather bag with the tassels. I'm gonna take the tassels off. I'm not really feeling that, but this bag is so, 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 so soft. This is what the handle looks like. Y'all, this bag is so soft. That's what made me buy it. It does come with the strap. I didn't even know this was in here. Okay. And it came with another bag. Hold on, let me break this apart so I can show y'all. Damn, if I don't want to carry the big one, it came with this. And it's so, so soft. Let's turn this off so we can see what the hardware looks like. Oh, yes. I'm so happy that I purchased this. This is a two-in-one bag. Yes. Then you can take the strap and clip it to this. And here's what the straps look like. Here's what the hardware on the strap looks like. It's adjustable. Okay, then. This is what the actual bag looks like. And I got this from Marshalls, y'all, for $29.99. So two bags for $29.99. And it's a good quality. Oh, I cannot stop rubbing this bag. I love the handle. I like everything on this bag except for this. It's pretty, but it's not my style. Here's what the hardware looks like on the sides. Let me see what the name of this bag is. It is the Calvin Collection Vegan Bag. Vegan approved. So if you ever wanna go into Marshalls and get this bag, I'm telling you this bag is so soft. Here are the tags. And you will not be disappointed. The quality, the way it feels. Oh my God, I love this bag. And then, I got this Steve Madden book bag purse. It has the Steve Madden hardware, the gold hardware. It also comes with your ID and credit card case, which you can detach it if you want to and put it on the inside. I would, I wouldn't want my credit cards or ID on the outside of my purse. Here's what the inside looks like. And I got it from Marshalls. And it was $29.99. Then I went to Aldi's. And I bought a bunch of fall scent candles. I got the pumpkin cream. The pumpkin ginger snap. The pumpkin cinnamon. I bought two of each. The apple harvest. I burned this one to see if it smelled. That's why I have it turned this way. But I already burned this one to see if the throw 
was any good, meaning I know I'm not the only one that goes and buys candles and then they smell good in the jar, but when you go home and burn them, they don't smell like anything. All of these candles smell exactly like they're supposed to. I live in a townhouse, and if I light these in my living room, I can smell them all the way upstairs in my bathroom and my beauty room. So these are my favorite candles. I got them from all these, like I said, and they were $3.95. I bought two cases. <laughs> so that's to let y'all know that I like them. And they smell so freaking good. I got the Honey Glaze Pear Cider, the Blood Orange. I got the Vanilla. I have the Cocoa Cove, the Tropical Escape. Then I have two Bath and Body Works candles, which is the Peach Bellini. Then I have the White Gardenia. They smell so good. And this Black Current Elderflower, it reminds me of the Black Cherry Candle at uh, Bath and Body Works. So these are all the candles that I got myself for my birthday. Because I just love candles and I love for my house to smell good. And these are the things that make me happy. So if you're interested in these candles, there are all these in the $3.95. So if you don't want to spend the $25 or $24.95 on candles at Bath & Body Works, this is a good brand, which is Huntington Home of candles. And I promise you, you will love them. And for $3.95, you could buy cases like I did. <laughs> okay, before I get into the perfume part of my video I just wanted to say the purpose of me showing you guys my hauls is because I try to show y'all things that you can buy on sale for a reasonable price and that are obtainable so you can go out and get them if you see them so I'm always going to be the youtuber that looks for deals and I'm going to tell you where they are okay with that being said let's get into the fragrances so this is my Third time shopping from Dossier. I'm, I'm sure you've seen this on YouTube a lot. The first time, let me see, this makes my 14th bottle of perfume that lets you know that I like it. So if you're into high-end perfumes and you want to pay the fraction of the price, as a matter of fact, they have a sale going on now. I'm going to leave the link in the description box below. As well as on the side, I'm going to leave, you can get, I think you could get five bottles for $89 or something. But I'm going to leave a picture in so you can see it. So the first one that I bought, okay, Dossier used to come with these little bottles right here. They no longer give you the bottles. And the reason why they gave you the bottles is because if you don't like the scent of the perfume, you could, re you could spray the sample and then if you don't like it, you could return the bottle. Now they've done away with the sample bottles. So if you spray this and you don't like it, you can still return it. What I like about these bottles is they have magnetic tops. This one is the Woody Sandalwood and it's, it's inspired by the Le Labo Santel 33. I'm sure these per perfumes are in the store for hundreds of dollars plus. But like I said, I have other things that I like that I will splurge on, but it it wouldn't be per I wouldn't spend two hundred dollars on a bottle of perfume. So I got the Woody Sandalwood, and like I said, it's inspired by the Le Labo Centile Thirty Three. I got the Aquatic Line, and it's inspired by the Giorgio Armani. These fragrances, I'm so glad that I like all of them, and and I wouldn't have to I wouldn't send them back if I didn't like them. But I'm glad I don't have to send them back. As well as I have the Oriental Oak Moss, which is inspired by Chanel Coco Mademoiselle. As well as I bought the Floral Pink Pepper, inspired by Dior.
So, all of these will probably run you $800 plus if you bought them in the department store. I paid like $132 for all, all four of these. But like I said, I just checked online before starting this video. And they do have a deal where you can get the more bottles you buy, the less you pay. So, I will leave the sale in the video as well as the link where you can order some Dossier perfume if you like in the description box. I've been hearing people rave about this Ebony Woods. Kyra I'm Unique has everybody buying this perfume. And I've had some YouTubers tell me about the perfume and I cannot stand it. So I'm glad that I was able to go actually go in the store and smell it. This is how it comes. It feels like a material of a shirt. Like it actually feels like fabric, the boxing. So let's open this together. Because as you can see, I've never opened it. And this is what it looks like. This bottle was $20. They do have a bigger one. Or you can get a small travel size. I think it's 10 This is what the packaging looks like. It smells really, really good. I don't want to steer y'all wrong. I don't do headache perfume. So yeah, I wanted to get me some fragrances for my birthday. So that's why I chose to get the Dossier perfumes as well as the Ebony Woods. There are some other fragrances that I told my family I wanted for my birthday. And if they don't get them, I'll go get them. <laughs> so I hope you guys enjoyed this haul. Don't forget to like, comment, share, and subscribe. And I will see you on the next video where I'm going to try out this TikTok eyebrow stamper thing.